Have you ever watched those viral AI music videos and thought how they create something so professional without a massive production budget? What if I told you that you could create your own viral AI music video with consistent characters and cinematic visuals using only one tool? Today, I'm going to show you how OpenArt is changing music video creation and making it possible for anyone to produce a music video that looks like it cost thousands to make it. So in this video, I'm going to share with you how to create your own AI music and your own AI music video with the help of open art, the exact process for generating cinematic visuals that match your music AI video, and the secret techniques that make AI music videos go viral on social media. The traditional video creation process is absolutely overwhelming for most creators. I always love music and dream of creating visual content that go with these songs. But every time I look into it, I feel completely defeat. And even worse, if you try to do it yourself with basic equipment, the results often look amateur and unprofessional which can actually hurt your music's reputation instead of helping it. That's when I realized there is two types of music creators. Those who accept that the professional music videos are out of reach and settle for basic visuals, and those who discover AI tools that can create cinematic content without traditional production costs. The difference is game-changing. One approach limits your music potential while the other opens up on unlimited creativity possibilities. And this is where Open R completely transformed my approach to music video creation. And to start with the creation of my music video, the first thing that you have to do is create your Open Art account. And if you don't have one, you can click the link in my description and create yours completely for free. Once you have your Open Art account, it's going to look exactly like this. So you can either go and click in music video, otherwise you can go and click in one click story. And then over here, we're just going to click in music video. It's over here where first of all, you have to go and paste the link of the music that you want to use. So to start with the creation with my music video, first of all, I'm going to also create my music with AI. And to do this, I'm going to be using Suno AI. Over here, I already opened my account and I'm just going to click in the section of create. It's in here where you can go and create your music from the simple version or you can even make it as a custom version. For the simple version, you can only go and describe your song and then you can go ahead and choose the style of your music. Otherwise, you can also go and make your own lyrics. And I think I rather use this option so I can see word by word my lyrics. And to do this, I'm just going to be using the help of ChatGPT. I'm going to be using this prompt. Create the lyrics of a song about Mariana, a YouTuber who wants to become a music superstar. And I'm just going to go and let it write it. So as you can see, we have our complete song over here. And this can be only an inspiration. After you get these ideas, then you can go ahead and then change it and add your own touch to this music. So I think I'm just going to go copy all of this and then just make the changes that I want in the Suno app. And once I already make my changes, what I have to do over here is also go and choose the style of music that I want for this song. So I'm just going to write pop. I think I also going to add Latin since I really like that kind of music. And you can even add combinations of styles. Over here, you can go ahead and enter the title of your song. So I'm just going to put Mariana pop star dream. And there we have it. Now we can click in create. And now we have the options that we can listen. Scrolling through the screen, yeah, I see my face. Editing at midnight, chasing my grace. Used to pull some fun, now I post the fire. Got my eyes on the charts, going higher and higher. From colors to carrots, I'm making a move. This girl's got a rhythm, got nothing to prove. Hard and ability, soul in the beat. I was born to stand, not stay in my seat. So I really like it, the second option, but I think between these options, I'm going to be using the first one. That's the one that I really like it the most. So now what we have to do is just go ahead and click in share. Now over here, we already have the link of our new 
song. You can go ahead and generate the best part, the video of this song. And to do this, we're just going to go and paste it into our open art account. So I'm just going to click in paste link and then I'm going to paste it over there. And now we can click in confirm. And now over here, we can go ahead and select the duration of our music video. So since we want it for the whole video, what you can do is make 60 seconds by 60 seconds. Since open art can only create 60 seconds by the time. So you can just go and generate part by part, or you can just choose a specific part that you want to create. So I think I'm just going to keep that section and I'm going to click in confirm. And now over there, we already have our music upload. Now, what we have to do is select a mode for our music video. And there is three types. We have the style, we have the story, and we have the singing version. So I'm going to show you how to create it with the three of them. First of all, we can start with the style one. And to do this, we can go ahead and select a style from uh, OpenR to generate this video. And as you can see, we have so many of them. We just have the Pixar style, the Ghibli style, the realistic one. We also have all of these options. So since I want my video to be very visually appealing, I think I'm going to be using this style since I feel it's very cool. So I'm just going to go, I'm going to click over it. And then we just have to go and choose our aspect ratio. So I'm just going to keep it in 16 by 9 and I can click in create story. And over here, open art already generated my video. So we can go ahead and take a quick look. So I think I really like it. I think the visuals are very nice. I think everything looks very cosmic. It's very entertaining to watch. But I just feel there is some little things that I would like to change. And to do this is very simple with the help of open art. I'm just going to go and select this scene that I want to change. So I think this one I don't really like. I think it doesn't really make sense with the fires on here. I think we can make something much better. And to do this, I'm just going to go. I'm just going to take a look to which scene it is. And we're just going to click in last view. So over here, I think it was this one. So what we have to do now is just go ahead and take a look of what is wrong. If the image is wrong or if the video is the one that it's making the mistake. So as we can see, the image is very nice. But what I like to change is that instead of this fire, we put a mouth in the middle. So first of all, I'm just going to go and recreate the image with a mouth in the middle. And then we can go ahead and remake the animation of this video. It will make more sense when I do it. So now I'm just going to go and first of all, change my prompt of my image. So over here, I think that's perfect. I'm just going to add with some lips in the middle. And now we can click in retry image. So it's going to make my image from scratch again. So I'm just going to go click and retry image and now we're just going to wait till it generates it again. And I think that's very cool. I think this image makes more sense and we can create something very nice with this. So now we just have to select our image and then we can click in retry the video. And now we just wait a few seconds till it generates also our video. And now it already generate our new video with our new image and we can just go and take a look of it. So that looks very good. That looks very cinematic and I really like it. So we're just going to go and click on the video and now we can go back to the timeline view. And as we can see, it already changed it. We don't really need to make that much changes and open art makes it very, very simple for us. So we don't need high editing skills. We just have to go and make some clicks to change it. Also, I feel like these scenes are very repetitive over here. So I'm just going to go and then make some adjustments. So we switch scenes and I think that looks much better now. And once you make all of your changes, you can go and click in share. And now we can click in download. Over here, I would recommend you to download as the last export. And now we can move on in our next option. We're going to make exactly the same, just upload our music. And then from here, we're just going to select the story type. To be honest, this is one of my favorite ones to create music videos and you will see why. 
Now, for this, we have two options. We have the auto story and we have the one star story. For the auto story, you only need to go and let the AI make everything for you. It will decide the story character and the story of it. Otherwise, you can just go ahead and create your own character. So you just go open your picture and you just give it a name. Otherwise, you can just also go and select from characters from open art. So as you can see, we have all of these options. And I think for mine, it looks very interesting, this one. So I'm just going to go and I'm going to select it. Over here, what I also recommend you to do is just go and select some story topics. So it's easier for open art to generate this story. So for mine, I'm just going to select futuristic hip hop adventure. So I think that will look very well in my music video. Now you only have to go and select your aspect ratio again for mine i'm just going to keep it in the same one and now we can click in create story and now open art generated for us so we can take a quick look so that was very nice i really like how every scene looks very cinematic i don't think i will get to this quality doing this kind of video with another tool i think the quality is just very good but we can go ahead and make few changes so it looks even better. And to do this, first of all, I will adjust some scenes that I think they will look better in other parts. So I think something like this will look better. And then we can even make uh, less long some parts. So the other parts also fit into the music that we have. So I'm just going to go and make this one more short. And there I think our story fits better into the music that we already have. And now in terms of changing the images, I really think everything looks great. But I think that we can just go and add some details to this scene to look even more organic, I would say. So we're just going to go and make exactly the same, least few. And then I'm just going to find that scene, which is this one. This, I think that the image is not the problem. I think the animation is a bit too much. So I'm just going to go and change that. As you can tell, I'm not a professional videographer, which kind of zoom in or zoom out to do. I'm just going to add a simple prompt and we can take a look of what uh, OpenR create for me. And we can go and click in retry video. And now it generates this video, which I think looks much better. It looks much clearer and I think that's perfect. So now we can go back to the timeline view and because I selected that video, it already changed it. And you can do that exact same process in this part over here. As you can see over here, we see the prompt of the image, which we can change like we did in the list view. And once you change this, then you select your image and then you generate your video again with retry video on this section as well. Both sections work exactly the same. So you can do either in this one or this one. And now it's just remaining that we adjust our video. And I think this video looks much better now with these little changes. And once we like our video, we can go and we can make exactly the same. We're just going to click in share and we have to download the last export. And now we can move in our last option. So now for the last one, I already pasted my music and we're just going to click in the section of sync. Over here, we have the exact same options. You can go and upload your character. Otherwise, you can go and try with one of open art. And I think I want to try with this one since it looks very interesting. And I would like to make this video for my TikTok account. So I'm going to go and make it for 9 by 16. And now you can click in create story. And now we can see what open art generate for us. Every 
I am very, very amazed how it's very accurate the lip syncing with the music video, which is what we wanted. Uh, and I don't think I have seen any other tools that make it that good as this one. I think every part of the video is very uh, cinematic. I think it's very high quality. I don't think I would make this kind of quality with something with another tool. And I think I really like it. I don't even think I need to change something on this. It's very, very good what we got with all only one try so we can do exactly the same if you want to you can just go click and make the changes if you want but I think for this one is perfect so I can go and click in share and we can click in download and we can make exactly the same I know that you might be thinking I don't have any experience with visual storytelling can I really create a very good music video well absolutely open art AI helps you and guide you to generate the best music video making very visually appealing compositions and you can start with the simple concepts and build your skills over the time the most important thing is matching the visuals to the music's emotions and energy and as you can see you don't even need any editing experience now you might be wondering what this incredible tool cost well when i think about traditional music video production hiring directors crews actors and renting the equipment, we're talking about five to fifty thousand dollars per video. OpenArt makes professional video creation accessible with subscription plans that can cost less than hiring a single video photographer for one day. And unlike traditional production, you can create unlimited videos once you have access to the platform. Think about it. If you create just one viral music video that boosts your music career, OpenArt pays for itself many times over. And with the ability to create multiple content, you can have a professional music video for every song you release. Now you might be thinking, I'm not sure if I'm creative enough to direct a music video. That's honestly why open art is so perfect. But here is something important to consider. AI music videos are having a major moment right now. Artists who embrace this technology early are getting massive attention and building a huge followings. But this advantage won't last forever. As musicians discover AI video creation, the novelty will disappear and the competition will increase. Start Now gives you the chance to build your visual brand and audience while this technology is still relative new and exciting. So here's what to do next. Click the link below and try open art and start creating your first viral AI music video. Pick one of your favorite songs and follow the process I just showed you. Create your music video this week and see how your audience responds to professional AI generated visuals. The future of music video creation is here. And open art gives you everything you need to complete with the major label productions using just AI technology. If you're also wondering how to create these consistent characters, I already have a video where I explain how to do that with the help of open art. And you can find the link to the video on my description. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you in another video. Have a great day.